Yeah, we on Boss Talk 101. Check it, check it, check it. It's a unique hustle. It's your boy ECO, and I'm here with the lovely official, Miss Jamaica. What's going on? Nothing, nothing, my dad walk Say, on. Say, man, look, man, I, man, we got exclusive right here, man. Mm -hmm. These niggas in trouble, man. Hey, man, I done pulled up on the block, man, and nigga really feeling himself right now. I got quick trip in there, man. What's going Say, on? Say, man, what's going on with you, man? Life. What was the, what the the first thing that 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 stuck out to you? Far as the the first son that you really knew, like I'm 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 doing my thing. The numbers went up, or, nah, or just the impact was. I'm gonna tell you, the impact was right. I got a song right. Mm -hmm. It's called We Ball It, Man Fresh. Okay, we took it in the club. I want to say for like three weeks. Did one song got us a mean what? Every label. But they all said the same thing, so I never put the song back out until like I get big. When going back to uh, Bankroll Fresh, when when you and him were working together, because y'all was working together a lot. Once he passed, how did that how did that kind of deal dealing with your career? How did that push things, one way or the other? I want to stop. You, I figured that. I wanted to stop, but then you know, like like I say, Fresh, my brother. So therefore, his mom is my mama. My mama is his mama. So therefore. It's a real life thing, not just an industry thing. Mm -hmm. like we've been together since we were like three, four. Yeah. So you got to think this, these real years of our life, like kids, like real babies. So when I got the call, I was leaving Future Show. Okay. Purple Rain tour in Atlanta at three, four. And then I was like, I got the call. He got grays. Who else? Jeezy. T.I. Well, Jeezy ain't here. Till. I can call Till. Okay. But look, that's a, guess what? That's a mentor to me. Really? That's you it. call him and we can, we, we'll stay and tomorrow. And we know him. That's um, crazy. If he, if he in town, I can call him. Because he was going like, I'm going to tell you something. Like, Who do you think would be a good interview? I'm going to tell you something. Yeah. No, I, I, I like T.I. I love T.I. T.I. is one of them ones. Like, he going to tell you the truth. Like, that's my that's one of them real mentors. I can say, if I call Tip and he missed a call, he going to call back. He I like one of people. Uh, uh, if he got his phone in his hand, he gonna pick up right then. Mm -hmm. Hey, quit you what you need. You need me for something? Uh, uh, well, yeah, uh, I need to holler at you about something. I be at the studio at this time. Come on, who you with? He ain't, or oh, come by yourself type. He like, who you with? Oh, wow. uh, yeah, don't don't bring a thousand folks. You know, ooh, I got my kids here. If he got his kids, they gonna tell you. If he, if he by himself, Tip really gonna be Ken. You come with 2,000 people along with their respect. Mm -hmm. oh, really? Along with their respect, he was recording. We've been, around, we've been in a He's few rooms together. He's always been a respectable person because nah, I've met him so many real times. Strong ones. He helped me get through a lot of a mm -hmm. lot of that, a lot of that tough times. Like I called and talked to him, you know, he lost for lunch. He lost a couple people yeah. on the road, and I know yeah. he probably got mm -hmm. blamed for a couple yeah. things. And I always just asked him how he get through it, and he always gave me real answers. Yeah, we on Boss Talk 101.